from sunset. And bring gold to the betting. Ah, oh, finally here. Rules are simple. Choose who you're going to run against, make your wager, then ride to Blackbow and back. First the winner, second the bleeding cunt. Got it? So, who are you going to race? Struttering Mama Mamatko, Iron Arse Hands, or Black Bogdan? I don't know how these guys. We'll just go with the first one. So right now we are involved in a race, guys. A horse race. You'll sit... I'll... Okay. Come on, let's set the wager and get racing. Okay, we go. Come on, Roach. Yeah, he is already in the front of me. What the hell is this? That's it. What the hell? Oh boy. I went the wrong way. Doesn't matter. I think he's way to the front. Wait, there he is. Okay, obviously they make him slow down for me. Cause I don't know how I caught him up just now. Okay, so we still win. That was weird though, cause he kept leading me and I keep catching up. Nice, nice. You seem to know horses as well as you do monsters. Here's your gold. And if the urge to race again grabs you, come see me. No, I'm good. Who else is racing? Right now. See now this here. Since I'm no I'm level four. Jesus Christ. Am I gonna ever level up? Level five. Devils, right? But you know what? They still don't agree with me, and I should should I should still try to get it straight. So we use a series room. Let's go check this out. Where's my horse? Hey, yeah. We're not too far from where we're supposed to be going, all right? So, Siri stayed to the spot. Come on, Roach. You got it, you got it, don't be scared. I just left the spot. The last gameplay. So, it's weird that I'm back here. Hey, yeah. Uh. Hmm, there we go. Sorry for hitting your head against, <laughs> against that, okay, buddy? Move it. Okay, and we are here. Come on, Roach. Got eyes like a cat. Look at you, Kate. So, Siri stayed uh, up here. What the fuck are you doing? What? So. What the hell I do? Sorry, my bad. Just chill, chill. Just looking for homegirl room, so I can search it. So Siri was here. Siri must have used these. Looks like she left in her. The Natural Obscurity of Curses by Lydia Van Breedevoort. Where'd Siri get this? A spinning top. Gritka's toy. Okay, is that it?
Thistle. Thistle. So you're Gretka. I am. And you're Geralt. How do you know? Because you've white hair and a medallion shaped like a wolf. Tell me about you. You and Siri talked a bit, didn't you? We did. Did she say where she was going, or what she came here to look for? She said she was looking for you, and a sorceress. But you're here, so I guess she didn't find you. I wonder if she helped that friend of hers. Siri wanted to help a friend? Any idea who it was? What do you mean, who? Her friend. She said he was in trouble and that she had to see him. Look familiar? My top! Where'd you find it? Siri's room. We'd play in her room sometimes. I was sad one day, and Siri carved it for me. Such a shame she had to leave. Siri wanted to help a friend? Any idea who it was? What do you mean, who? Her friend. Oh. She said he was in trouble and that she had to save him. Do you know where Siri I wish you knew. Well, one day I brought her breakfast and she was already gone. The Baron told me she'd left. Didn't ask where she'd gone? I did. But he said I was too little and I wouldn't understand. But Siri left me a gift. A gift? Yes, this. A green stone. Beautiful as gifts go. Hide it well. Don't show it to anyone. It's worth a lot. Okay. She didn't have enough info for us, man. I'm not playing. I'm helping. Gonna kill the monsters. All of them. Okay, little crazy girl. Read the book from Siri's room. What's this? That's a brick. Hmm? Why do you guys go read, okay? So I don't need to do that for you. So that was the book? Hmm. A dedication to the Baron and his wife. Seems they have friends in high places in Vizima. Let's get those two earlier. Okay, we we did see his room. Fuck's on a lot of you. Nope, let's see if here's some of those secondary ones. See what you do. And most of these are close by anyway. Yeah. I'll talk to you, nigga. Oh, there you are. That's it, Roach. Okay. Move it. Don't stop riding my awesome Now this next mission here, I'm not sure what it is. I talked to the hunter name Nealin. So we're just gonna go talk to that this the son of a whoever. Let's see what information they got for us or whatever the mission is. And this game is hella long, okay? Tell you that right now. Oh, this road. Oh, hold on, hold on. Hold on, let's help this lady here. Old feeble woman. What's wrong? To their night blasphemers, pop <clears throat> take and profane the shrine to Verna the Merciful. Shrine's gotta be repaired, else Verna will take umbrage. Her cows will croak, and kitties will be covered in warts, and our dogs will get the mange. 
Really? Warts and a lot of statue. Sounds dangerous. Fine, I'll help you. That's an ugly shrine, y'all. The good gods have sent thee to me. Someone to repair their shrines from this day on. Look, already got a trade. I'm a witcher. Restoring traditional roadside structures in wood. Just not my specialty. Yeah. That's a witcher's calling. And vandals are worse than beasts. Really? Fine. I'll fix them if I see them. Shrines? I'll take care of them. Won't go out of my way, though. Nothing's out of the way in these parts, and the gods will guide you. All right, crazy woman. Let's go, horse. Run, Roach. Okay, look like we re we are arrived. What are you doing in the rain, boy? Looking for a hunter named Neelan. Found him. What do you want? Hear about your notice. I'm a witcher. When do you last see your wife? Oh, five days past. Before dawn. On my way out to hunt, she were asleep. I come back. I'm no sign of her. Maybe she went to the neighboring village. Forgot to tell you. No. My sister were never gone this long before. Tried looking for her? Asked around the village, none saw her go. She must have left when they were still sleeping. Told her time and again not to wander off on her own. She never listened. I must have some menfolk to scour the woods. Nothing. Can I go look for her? Look in the woods. You might have missed something. Ask around, too. She have any friends? Hannah kept... keeps to herself, mostly. Watches the blacksmith's youngins at times. And in the village, Glenna, the butcher's wife, she likes her best. Thanks. I'll try to find her, but no promises. Alright, so let's start investigating this shit. Okay. Hey. Greetings, you Glenna. Hi. The gristle and marrow is all I'm willing to sell, and you'll have to wait till I'm done carving it. Wanted to talk to you about Hannah. Hear you were friendly. She come by at times? We talk? She seems strange lately. Any idea where she might have gone? Hmm. Strange. No? A cheerful soul always. If I'm to judge, it's the wolves got her. Been howling the nights through lately. Even the Baron's men are feared to come by. Hannah must have gone to the wood to gather mushrooms, maybe. Straight too deep and the howlers got her. Hmm. Is that so? You the butcher's wife? Butcher? Please. Might have called him a butcher when we lived in the shade of Novigrad's walls. Now he deals in carrion, fallen animals. Their bones still fit for soup. So, buying something? Nope. Thanks. Farewell. Now who's next? I'm the police in this part. Okay. Wow. My dad used to make swords like yours. Can I touch it? It's sharp. No. Better not. Need to talk to your father. I forged swords once. Now it's sides and o's. For good arms, you'll need to go to Novigrad. Wanted to ask you about Hannah. Heard she looked after your children. Of uh, Hannah? Do you know where she is? No, that's why I'm here. She maybe tell you where she was going, or anything else? Mm. She said turnips are healthy, and we ought to eat them. I saw her go to the forest, with another lady. It was dawn almost. I'd gone out so I wouldn't wet the pallet. The forest? She's done for. Why? 
A huge pack roams the area. None from the village dares go in the forest. Neelan's only one not afeared, but then he's a hunter. Hmm. That person who stood there. The woman. Know who it was? No. She walked in front of Aunt Hannah. I couldn't see. All right. <coughs> Those guys in the background fighting. Okay, so we gotta go in the woods. I'm gonna need my steed for this one here. Let's do this, buddy. What the? Stop running. There you go. That's it, Roach. Okay, guys, let's go into the woods and see if we can find this lady. Faster. Not so fast, Roach. That's it, Roach. What's this? <coughs> what do you want? Want to talk to the Peller? Too late. We've got dibs on a chat with him. A long one. Ah. God damn, I need to upgrade that thing. Maybe we can make a deal. We'll not plow in bargain with no one. Vengeance. That's what we want. Okay. Get the hell out. Gotta... Now. <laughs> and here I thought we'd have a day without corpses. Herb Majors pay top coin for the special bits of rare creatures. Wonder how much we'll get for his eyes. Hold on, hold on now. Hold on. All together, now. Come here. Whoa. That's a good move. <coughs> Whoa. That guy with a long thing, he doesn't even have this. Oh, yeah, there's a, a down freaking. That's who was hitting me. That's who was hitting me. That bastard. Y'all should have just leave. That's what. Hmm. But no. Not a man who could get Hedrick's friends all worked up. Okay, so that'll be it. Okay, good. Let's see who the hell's in here that caused these guys want to fight. It's the police. Hey, anybody home? Open up, it's safe now. Devils, who do they bring? What seek ye? I need your help. Ooh, a man, nay, a wolf, grey, though not old. Tis he that okay. awaits. The chicken feeder on his head. <laughs> this is ridiculous, it's a crazy dude. <coughs> Recognize this. Made of spruce wood, strong smell of juniper, designed to protect someone. So who is he, the chicken man? Sprinkled with goat's blood, then tempered with an incense of earth, smoke, and juniper. For Anna, to protect her. Hmm. So, designed to protect her. From what? From what? Oh, the dear. Besieged she was, evil all around, wanting to possess her. Old magic born of oblivion from dark sources emerged. Old magic? Can you be more specific? It is not for mouth speech, nor for the touch. A small protective charm, not a thing more a Pella could do. Hmm. Anna and her daughter are missing. 
Know where they are? Nay, no, nay. Pella don't know. But the spirits could know. The Pella will augur, the spirits ask. Spirits? Great. Fine with me. Long as I know where to look, where to find them. Lost, lost, must be found. Princess! None better than princess for finding things. Princess? Which princess? Princess! My goat! She's fled! <laughs> Those men must have scared her off. Can we get back to the auguring? Without the goat? Impossible. No goat? <laughs> Won't work. Great. Will you help me if I bring the goat back? Princess! Princess! Where have you got to, girl? Fine. I'll get your goat. The bell. The little bell's ringing. She loves it. Ring, ring, and she will follow. But for a while. But beware of wild strawberries. Raspberries, too. Yeah, treacherous as beasts go. I always keep an eye out for them. Okay. Okay, so that's how we do it. This way, I think. So instead of spending all my time fighting in this game, they got me chasing a freaking goat. That's just great. That's awesome, because that's what I need to be doing right now. Hey, is that the goat? Ah. Where are you? I'm not, I'm hearing you. Where are you? The walls I kill. I, I'm hearing this go, but I don't see it. Man, this game not a waste people time, y'all.
fucking bear. What the hell? Okay, this is frustrating me now, okay? <coughs> Guys, I'm going to end it right here. <coughs> Y'all can check me in the next episode because the time already run.